took me a little while to sort of take on the business because I didn't know if I wanted to work with my mom, and then I tried it and it was like second nature. Hi, I'm Nona Darren, also known as the Vagina Designer. I've been waxing for almost 20 years. Started uh, the business with my mother. It's a family business, Russian family business. I think Russians are known for waxing. <laughs> so I think Americans are a lot more squeamish and they don't teach all the stuff in school. And Russians are just like, okay, we're all women. Yeah. Take it off, get in there, and do it. And, uh, I was born and raised in Russia, so uh, it's sort of it's part of the culture there. And I've been written up in a bunch of magazines for different shapes and things like that. And a reporter came in and said, Oh, so tell me, you know, how would you describe yourself? What do you do? I'm like, well, you know, I'm the vagina designer. And I honestly did not think she was going to quote me on this, but she did. And I was in the Chronicle as the vagina designer, big letters, you know. Anyway, you don't need to enunciate, especially the anus part. Of it. I said something on the phone to a client that supposedly I wasn't supposed to say. I am confirming your appointment. I'm a man, woman. Wanna see? <laughs> For brows and to Uranus and back. This is why I have to micromanage these situations because it's the image of my salon. Oh my god, are you kidding me right now? The more you bitch at me, you know, the more it goes out and I forget and it happens again. I think yes, the, the dryer, the dryer needs fixing. I do all the stuff here that doesn't get paid. Uh, light bulbs, electrical work, window glazing, cable wax jobs, and test bottle. Classics, well, one of the stories actually, just one, was the, <laughs> the, the lighting bulb one. No, no, I just talked to a new client. She wants to do a lightning bulb in blue. And she's like, I gotta practice, I gotta see if I can do it, because she's got a dry hair, you know, light dark hair. And I've never done a lighting bulb, so I'm gonna need to practice on someone. Sure. She, you know, she gives me a wax job. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? I am. I realized that the next day, I just didn't think of it. I have a physical. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Welcome to my paying job. It's a conflict resolution specialist that's confidential and neutral. However, in the context of my wife's business, it is it is highly sought after. The counseling aspect in the context of my marriage. You know, I should be a shoe salesman because then my advice might be better, better taken. You know, we used to walk around naked all the time yeah. in front of my kids, and they're just so used to seeing me with a Brazilian because that's right. what I do. That one time, um, my Nikita was, I, I hadn't done it for a while, and he'd walk by me and he said, Oh my god, your vagina is so hairy! <laughs> I was like, High standards for future girlfriends. For sure. <laughs> You know, uh, she's got her own therapist, but you know, she, she could use a few, five more. I walk in the room and she's got a large pink organ hanging out of her vagina. And she's like, oh, oh, nothing, it's just my prolapsed uterus that fell inside my vagina. <laughs> it's just... There is a lot of crazy people who get into that business. Like I was training a girl and I was in the facial room and she knocks on my door and she's like, oh my god, I'm so sorry, but I waxed her butt cheeks together, I don't know what to do. She had this one person in there who was diagnosably bipolar, meaning when she was there and up, she was great. I just waxed the stinkiest <laughs> butt hole. But and she's like, she calls in my wife one day and says, I I'm going to L.A. Breathe, just breathe through your mouth. Just can't you do that? She's like, I can't do that. But it's just like if I do that, it's like I'm eating it. <laughs> Three months later, she's like, oh, I want to come back. So you know, this, and, and, and so you know, that was sort of the style of people that Nona uh, has had to deal with. So we come home completely naked. He looks at me, and there's a little dress. 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 With his Italian without English, he's like, Che cazzo vuoi questo? What did you do there? Hitler. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, what the fuck is that? Why do you have Hitler? Because they're not used to it. They groom, but, but they're not, not as much. Not as much. He's like, I don't like that. I like a bush. Yeah. I yeah. like a bush. Like groom bush. He goes, you look like a fucking Hitler. I'm not gonna fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Those people are crazy. Thank you guys. Thank you. This was an awesome day. I don't know. Someday it's just gonna all just go.